Hey there, what's up? This is Rob from Panther and I gotta show you how to make animations in Photoshop. Uh, this tool is really old school. Nobody is using it pretty much. It's uh, pretty basic, but uh, it does some nice, really nice things. So first thing, make sure you click on the windows and select timeline. And it's gonna, this thing is going to appear. Basically here, you're gonna edit the frames and whatever related to video and uh, animation. Next, go to layer select video layer and from here go to the new blank video layer and you can see here at the layers it created this interesting uh, layer where you can see this video kind of symbol down here you also can see this layer here is going to go the frames this is the ppp this is the you know the sketch the drawing and basically we're, we're going to work with uh you know this layer also, you need to do another thing, click on this and make sure you enable the onion skins. So what does the onion skin do? There's like, you're gonna create like new frames, frames after, after frames. Let's say you draw something and uh, you know that you make it with full black. After you create a new frame, the previous frame gonna be like, you're gonna decrease the opacity by 50%. So you can see the, also the previous frame and how you are evolving frame by frame and uh, you, you can see the process of the animations. So let's create our first. Okay, I also gonna create a new layer because uh, so this is going to be the final P and uh, I'm gonna start from a Time New Romance P letter. So I'm gonna start it from this one, okay. Let's recolor this to something grayish. There you go. So I'm gonna redraw this and I'm gonna transform frame by frame into the sketch, like this thing right here. I'm gonna go back to this layer where I'm gonna edit. All right, so we're gonna speed up the clip and see what we can do. Okay, so this is the fir first frame I gonna, where's the T, I gonna click on this. So basically I copy pasted it because I wanted to, um, you know, make it like this sketchy, like you can also see like the imperfection. So it's not a perfect uh, P how, uh, you, you know, it's the font and uh, I like uh, this kind of feel. Anyways, so how do we get to the next frame? What, basically, you need to click on this little thing. You click on it, and as you can see here, it just jumped a frame. Uh, the onion effect just kicked in. It decreased uh, uh, the opacity. Now it's transparent, the piece transparent. Now you can see the original, like uh, the first frame, and this is the end frame, like where we're going. And now you, you just can draw the next frame after next after next and right now i can see like where i go i'm gonna expand for example here because i need to go right there and uh, i'm gonna expand the whole design because that's the end goal and here is going to startly start to you know you know to uh cut in two pieces because the p is gonna go like that so yeah, let's speed up the process a little.
All right, finally, we got the letter P finished, evolved. I'm gonna uncheck the sketch, so we're gonna remain with the... And of course, I'm gonna uncheck the onion skin, so it, it's not shown anymore because you can see also the previous layer on the... And now you can see only the final. And as you can see, if I pull this, I'm just gonna do it back. You can see the you can see the texture on it. So I didn't uh, fill with uh, with the color. I sketched the whole thing. So you can see the sketchy effect that uh, kind of grungy, grainy stuff going on. So yeah, this uh, is kind of the, I'm gonna make this short. I think it was like 10 frames. It ends right here. Something in that line. Whoa. Anyways, it's too fast. I'm gonna make it shorter eventually. Oh yeah, of course you can make it shorter too. I mean slower, sorry. So uh, to make it slower and do some edits, uh, you can just click on this. And there has to be like a right click option or something option that uh, gonna make, make uh, you know, gonna slow down the whole thing. Ah, oh, there you go. You just right click on this, duration is five seconds. Speed 100%, we're gonna decrease it a little bit to I think 30 something. Uh, okay, let's, let me try this out. So yeah, now it's now, and now it basically works slower. Boom, there you go. So it's gonna end up, uh, yeah, of course, my favorite uh, option uh, is another thing, like I gonna invert the colors so it looks more fancy. Ooh, that looks nice. So yeah, basically this is how you do this and you also can save it somewhere around here. You just click on it and click on render video. And you're gonna select the folder where you wanna save it. Uh, the dimension is right this. Quality, you can check what quality you want and just click on render, that's it. All right, this is how you do it. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can notify with daily updates and check out the other videos. Have a good day. Bye-bye.